<laughs> Let's play! Whoa! Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You all may call me Pharaoh, and welcome to what was going to be an episode of What's Gaming, until I found out that this is actually a pretty short little experience, and I'm like, you know what? We'll just go ahead and cover it all in kind of like a one-shot thing. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Florence. From what I understand about this game, it's like a nice little narrative. And this originally came out around two years ago, around this time, for mobile, uh, mobile phones. And it won like a lot of awards. And this came out around Valentine's Day of this year, so a couple weeks ago, uh, on PC. And the good people over at GOG were kind enough to provide me a review code of this, uh, because when I saw this, what really you know stuck out to me was the art style. Because I don't know about you guys, but it reminds me of The Little Prince, or Le Petit Prince, if you guys ever read that uh that book um it, it just reminds me so much of it and but now even listening to the music and just seeing the visualization kind of come to life i'm like you know what this might be something i'm very interested in because i like these different narrative games and, and I, I may use game the word game a little loosely here because i'm not sure exactly exactly what we're going to be doing here but it looked unique enough for to see what it could offer. So I'm just going to go ahead and go through the, the game in its entirety. I'm not sure how long it's going to take. Uh, if you guys are interested in picking this game up for yourselves, I will include a link to the GOG page in the description below if you guys want to go ahead and check it out yourselves and buy it. So um, actually, before we get going, let's take a quick look at the settings here. Uh, everything is good. I'm going to leave paper effect out. I'm using my mouse instead of a controller, but let's go ahead and uh, get going. Chapter 1, Adult Life. And I'm assuming this takes me back? Yes, okay. Let's go ahead and go forward then. Florence Yeo. 25 years old. 7 o'clock. Ugh. Hell no, I hate that. Ah, uh, yep. Pushing a good old snooze button. I've done that God knows how many two times, like just too many times to count. Oh, all right, I guess we're gonna brush our teeth. So see, see what I mean here, guys? It's like, it's like little stuff, little experiences, but that's what the game is, you know? Oh, where am I? Oh, look, she's on Tinder and whatnot. Yeah, yep, yep. This is stupid. I, you shouldn't be always constantly clicking like, 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 like. Well, actually, I don't think that was Tinder. That might have been like Instagram or something. Oh, uh, what? Well, this is a job. Oh, is this, is this, oh, it's just, okay, I'm sorry, I was like, do I just push random things? Like, no, just do it all together. There you go. So she might be an accountant. Oh, hello, mother. <laughs> and, uh, I'm fine. Oh, no, you do not have to find a boyfriend for me. <laughs> Okay. I I'm a little busy. I gotta get back to work. Parents, you know. I mean, honestly, it's kind of like that. Uh, oh, yoink! yoink. I, I don't like sushi, but you know, hey, you know, more power to anyone else who does. But yeah, I mean, I, I get those calls too. And even if I'm busy, I'll I'll make the time to speak to my parents or siblings or. Family or friends, it's like, you know what? It's the least I can do. Ah, so she she kind of, she someone has a full day, but I'm kind of already seeing a pattern come about. Oh, that was chapter one, yeah. Guys, that, damn, this game's a little relatable at this point. I mean, yes, uh, that is essentially adult life. Wake up early as hell, groggy as hell. Get ready for work, do the work, go back home, relax for a little bit, 
sleep, rinse, and repeat. Do that for about, like, you know, 30 or 40 years and enjoy the rest of life. Memories, huh? <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, no. What's that? I don't know, I just, this her sitting down looks a little funny here. I, I like it, though. What are you reading there, Florence? Oh, oh. This is when life was simple. This is when I didn't have to worry about taxes and adulting. But it's not a story about me, it's a story about Florence. Yay, colors! Um. All right, let's, oh, okay, let's make the, how do I do this? No, I don't want to make it that color. Huh? Do I have? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is... Oh, this is something, guys. Yes. I am loving this. I'm going to put this on the wall when I'm done. It's like, look what I did. Be happy for me. Oh god, what am I doing in my life? I was always bad at coloring and whatnot and cutting paper. I, I just I just do not know what the hell is wrong with me. Uh sure. And then a star. A couple stars actually. No, we'll just make all that in. How about that? That looks a little weird. Yeah, I could have changed the colors here, but that that's a work of art. Like, like this. Oh! <laughs> I, I was like so happy. I was like, ooh! <laughs> yeah, a little heart. Uh, I don't know where to put these things now. Right there, maybe. Um, and for a hell of it. No, it's not. How about. Just a dash. Yeah, there, that, that's a. That's a thing. That's a thing. Good job, Florence. You did it. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> okay. Hey, you know, you, you, it is important to do well in school, but I don't think this is the proper way to do it. Like, legit micromanaging every little thing. Uh, that is that. I'm gonna pray to God I know how to do my math still. Uh, yeah, okay. How many times have I got to do this? That is a 12. Yeah, just all down. She, I know, I know Florence, it sucks. I know life is not all about school. It's not all about good grades. They teach us that it, it will give us success in life, and that's not always guaranteed, but I think it helps somewhat. Aw. This is probably going to hurt right now, because... I don't know if you guys have ever had friendships that come and gone it's no see it's one of those things that it unfortunately happens okay this hurts damn it I, I knew this game was going to delve into like things like this and I, I think the main things about like relationships and whatnot and I think a lot of it is going to I'm going to find a lot of, I don't know if you want to say resemblance or uh, things of my own to relate to. And I may go into it at the end of all this. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see. But this is life. Looking back at the stuff we did. You know, I'm not... Um, hmm. I'm not going to lie to you guys, I did something very similar to this uh, about a couple months ago. I was, uh, I found a bunch of my stuff from high school, and when I was in grade school actually. A junior high, going to freshman year of high school. I found some of my old stuff, I found my old agenda, I found notes that I wrote to myself, and I legit did the same thing that Florence is doing right now. I, I, uh, I looked at it for a while, and... I put it away. <laughs> um, yeah. 
it's the reminiscing. It's like, I wonder what I could have done different. Yeah. I think this game's going to ruin me a little bit. I like music. What do you listen to, Florence? Yeah, I like all the pictures. Doggy! Now, I don't really... Oh, that sucks. I hate leaving my place if there's absolutely no music. I, I mean, uh, no charge. I have to have my phone charged at all times. We're just walking along. But I, I, I don't go on Instagram or like stuff when I'm out and about walking. Maybe when I'm sitting down or something, but not when I'm out and about. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, this doesn't happen to me often. <laughs> it would be cool if it happens, I guess, and never, nobody gives a, uh, gives a damn if I start floating around the sky or floating around the sidewalk, but... You know, sometimes... I, th I think we all have experienced music like this where it's just... It's just you feel good about it, you know, just go by your day. Almost like you don't have a care in the world. Like, today is your day. Accomplish what you want to accomplish. Some, some music does that for me. Like, I, I like a whole genre, like a whole, like a range of music. I hope I don't have to collect all those. Like, I, I like listen to a whole lot. Um, sometimes I listen to classical, oh, jazz as well. But this is beautiful. And I think I see where this is going. She's attracted. Oh, Florence! Come on, girl. I uh, I think we've all we've all also been there. You know, the whether whatever gender or whatever you guys may like, and you you see something or, or someone. Or they do something that you like, and then you, they're on their, your mind the rest of the day. Yeah. Yeah. I think we've all been there. But see, look at that. That was Act 1 already. And, like, we were, we're only, like, 13 minutes in with me talking about nonsense. So, like I said, this, this is going to go pretty quickly. But this is something I want to share with you guys. I think you guys will enjoy this. Crash. Oh, boy. Sad to say, I never learned how to ride a bike. I don't know why. <gasps> she found a cello player! Oh, okay, wait, well, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I think that we got it there. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Yeah! Good job! And, uh... <laughs> ouch. Well, this is always fun when this happens, right? There you go. Oh man, everything went everywhere. <laughs> is she okay? Florence? Florence, things are gonna be alright. There you go. Well, she has her helmet. See, that's a good thing. Oh, is that who I think it is? It sure looks like it. Hey, sometimes this happens, and I'll tell you guys of a story after we're done with all this. Um, I, I just hope. I mean, I don't. I don't want to get super personal with stuff like this, but we'll see how what happens. Hi, look at that. Oh, okay. Good that they're talking. Oh! She got the digits! Krish. Okay. I wonder if that no number actually works. First dates. Oh my god. Yeah, this is kind of... This is... Very relatable. <laughs> oh man. You know, I don't think I ever took... No, no. First dates for me, like, w w parks, 
And then we actually have like lunch or dinner. I don't think I've been to like a cafe for coffee. I haven't done that. Uh, ooh, what well, we're trying to, oh, okay, I see. We're, we're trying to make a conversation happen. And I'm, uh, what I'm assuming here is like, it might be a little difficult to like think of something you're trying to pe legit, like legitimately piece together what you'd like to say. Um, and I can understand it. It can be kind of intimidating and frustrating because you, you want to sound interesting. You, you, you want to participate and pray to God they, they like the conversation and, huh. Oh, look at that. It's actually a little bit easier now. I think I see what's going on here. I'm going to confirm it right now if we do have to, if we got to do a puzzle again. Queen Victoria Market. Oh, yeah, look at that. They're on another date. <laughs> Burrito, I think. That's what I just had today. Yep. I know exactly what they're doing. They're getting a lot more comfortable with each other. And it's easier to speak with them. Dear God, how this is true. I love this. And then it just becomes like second nature. Oh my god! I was about, I was like I was about to ask, does it go there? <laughs> I do puzzle games good, sure. Can't even speak properly. But yeah, I mean, this is a nice way to put it. That yeah, you know, once you get to know this person more and more, and you go out with them, you just enjoy your time with them something clicks you love talking to them you get closer to them oh and then that's it you just kind of fit I don't think I should have played this game. That out of thing about it. Um, no, no, it's it, not to say I shouldn't have played it. It's I'm like I'm actually loving this experience so far. It's more so that it, it's making me think back to my own past, you know, life, my past life, but memories of my own relationships and everything like that, and. <laughs> yeah L let's see what what happens if we keep going, continuing this is act 3 now, dreams so we know his dream I'm assuming being a cello player but I'm not really sure about Florence yet maybe they're talking about it here what do you guys want to do oh okay so yeah, look, he wants to be a famous cello player, and he, he seems very, very talented in what he does, so maybe he'll get there. Okay. What about you, Florence? What do you want to do? <laughs> well, okay, we're still talking about him. What, him getting like a... <laughs> okay. Hey, it's a dream. All right. Maybe Chris one day will get there. Okay, but what do you? What about you, Florence? You have, you have a dream, yeah. Yeah. Okay, no, she's taking it back out again. Uh huh. Oh, she wants to be a painter. Florence, go for it. Go for it. You're 25. If there's something I've learned in my life right now, and I just turned 29, it is you are never too old. Like, there's no such thing as running out of time to do what you want to do. I wish that was something I didn't learn when I was a lot younger. But it also does mean that it's okay there's no rush there's no 
time limit to a lot of things in life. Just enjoy life. What's your inspirations, then? Oof, buddy. Come on, man. I, I hate a clutter. And I, I, I have... I, I, I really need to learn from myself, like, or take my own damn advice, because I, I need to clean up around around here as well. It's, but it's one of those things where I... I need, like, a clean slate. Like, this... This is nice. Good. Good for him that, you know, we clean it up in a matter of seconds. I wish it was that easy in, in real life, but... Okay. Well, are we moving in? Huh? What'd she find? Yeah, hey! Academy Music? Yeah, dude, why... Why don't you go for this? I mean, we obviously know his dream. He wants to be a famous ch uh, cello player. Go for it. Yeah, see? Support. I love this. Come on. Go. Go. Do your thing. Now, Florence, what about you, though? I want you to do your thing, too. Look at that, see? She's super talented. <laughs> Look at that. Ah, oh. Exploration. Alright. Well, let's see. What is this? What? Oh. It's a pol- you know, a good old pol pol uh, Polaroids forest hike. Okay. I went hiking once. It was fun, but very exhausting. <laughs> it's music, friends. Hey, it looks like a tubla. Well, at least that's the Arabic uh, drum thing. It's, it's pretty cool. Arabic, the Egyptian tongue, uh, tongue thing. God, drum thing. I can't talk. Uh, that, that might be me. Like, I cannot do fish. As much as I want to try sushi, but I, I just don't do fish. Oh, she kind of immig uh, immigrated. Integrated into his family. That's awesome. What about him meeting hers? I'm curious about that. The art gallery. All right. Something that she's very interested in. Okay. <laughs> Skateboard lessons. All, all this other stuff. See? That is awesome. Ah. <sighs> Well, that was Act 3. Act 4? Groceries. Alright. Grocery shopping can be blah sometimes. Other times, like, hey, yeah, you need it. So, uh, yeah. Huh? Oh, sorry, I was about to mess, mess that up. Uh-huh. I have a bad feeling about something here. Was that? Oh, it's going back and forth. Okay. Now it goes to him. Oh, no. Okay, see how the puzzle pieces are getting a little bit more like, you know, they're, it's not as smooth, but you can still easily talk. Oh no. Yeah, see, I mean, now unfortunately, this also happens in a relationship. I personally believe that a healthy relationship, and see how it's going, it's, it's giving, it's being more and more curt, like it's like, uh, it's quickly and, oh well, is this like a race about who's talking to who? Hold on a minute, guys. This, Oh no, see, this isn't this isn't being so hot. Yeah. So, as I was saying, uh I personally believe a healthy relationship may have 
some disagreements, some arguments, like nothing, I wouldn't say anything super, super duper huge, but I also don't believe that agreeing with every single little thing the other person says or wants to do is healthy because I mean, I feel that it's like a legit, like one in a zillion chance that you're going to find somebody exactly like I'm, I'm like legit exactly happy with every little thing that their partner wants to do. You know, it's okay to have disagreements. It's, it's okay. Let's say, I don't say it to have arguments, but to resolve those disagreements, that's where I'm getting at. Uh, I, I hope that this is just one of those things where, okay, they will, uh, you know, they, they'll have to fix it. We'll see. See? I mean, this also takes me back. It really does. And then, yeah, and then just continue on. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Six months later. Okay. That's a really big step. Moving in. Um, now, personally, I haven't done anything like that. I, to me, I'd say that's a huge, huge thing for me. And um, I don't know. And uh, let's see. Well, it doesn't matter where we put what. I mean, I kind of want some symmetry here, but eh. I guess that kind of works. Uh, I, I guess I put that away for now. I, I don't have room for it. Uh, what, what what is what is that? Uh, what is this? I don't know. I mean, if you want a metal and post that, fine, we'll do that. And sure, we'll do that. And okay. Oh, but I don't really have room for most of my stuff here. I mean, did I just did I just put everything away now? There's a lot here I have. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this I've seen this scene multiple times in life. Uh, it's like, where to fudge lie? There, there, that's all you have left. So wait, who's moving in where? I just realized that. Because now this seems like his stuff with hers. And it's like... Uh... There's legit no room. Oh god, I can see this causing problems already. Uh, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, dude. Oh. That's a picture of his own family. I wonder if something I could have done. Or, like, should I take... Could I have taken stuff away from there and put that in storage? I think I did that wrong, but, look, like, they're still happy. That looks like a very cozy scene right there. Oh, hell yeah! See? Oh, yeah, did you do... You did it? Oh, present... Hey! See, they know each other's interests. For God's sakes, they better. You've been together for six months. Happy together. But it worries me with the inverse of colors. <laughs> okay. Yep. Hey, that's a good snooze. Nom, 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 nom. That actually looks pretty tasty, whatever. Except the coffee. I am not, I'm, I'm not a huge coffee person, like, whatsoever. I just, I could never get into coffee. Da, da, da. Wink. It's my, uh, heart. Laugh. Send. Lots of emojis in things like this as well. I gotta say. I don't even know what conversation we're having, but it's like, ah, oh, this works. I'm 
I'm sure work is yeah, look at look how look how productive she is at work. That's that's also kind of true as well. Da -da 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 -da. Oh wait. Oh wait, do I take it off and pick it up again? Don't want to get it too hot now. Ooh, what, what are they making? They're doing their interests together. She is really good at this, I gotta admit. But has she been pursuing it per se? Like, he went to the Academy of Music and did application. What about herself? I, I don't. Maybe I missed that, but I don't think she's done anything with that just yet. Oh boy. Getting into the routine, kind of like back in Act One. It might be a little. Hmm. Wow. Okay. A whole year later. How's everything coming along? Okay. I mean. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Th this is their everyday life. I mean, I'm not saying it can be exhausting to be, you know, lovey dovey 24 7, but I mean, it's life. You know, there's other things going on, you know, that th this is exactly just like how her adult life was. You know, it's like she was doing the same thing. It's with him. Yeah, but he's also busy with with music as well. And I'm fine, mother. I'm fine, mother. You don't have to find a boyfriend for me. Uh, she has it taken care of. I'm doing work. Okay. But look how look how his face is. You know, like they're. How do I how do I put this? It's like there's nothing wrong with being comfortable with each other like this, especially when you've been together for like a year. Um, and dear God, I am not like any type of marriage counselor, couple therapist, anything like that. But oh no, erosion. But sometimes that spark fizzles out, and you f find ways to reignite it. I guess. Uh, see, kind of like. Is she part of her friends? See, they're the lovey dovey, then they're close, and now they're just chilling. And then they're just kind of doing their thing. Yeah. But it seems like he's, you know, pursuing what he wants to pursue. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at him. I think it's one of those things where this is what he wants, but this is reality. You know, and it, it's it's going to be very hard, especially in something that he's doing, like this music. I can imagine it's not it's not going to be something like glory all the time, and all this time she has not even touched her paint stuff okay oh boy fight now like I said there are times where arguments happen disagreements happen and some sometimes it's just the best kind of you know, give some space. Don't yell. Don't say things you don't mean. But look how... See how fast and snappy his stuff is? It's like, it's a little... Like, what the hell? You know? Like, he's being quick with us. It's snappy. That's This is not... Look at her. This is not... Healthy right now, I think, what's happening. I know I said a healthy relationship can have disagreements, but how this is being done, it's... I don't know. Once I'm just inferring on what I'm seeing here. Oh, jeez. 
and how red symbolizes anger or invokes anger, supposedly. Are they crying? Or am I... What is that? By their eyes. It's just artistic flair. Jeez, what are they getting in a fight about? Or does it even matter, you know? Like, they're having... They had a huge fight. Now, that's something I obviously don't agree with. Don't have a humongous fight like that. I mean, like I, like I mentioned before, I don't think you're always going to agree with one another, but... Um, <clears throat> to have a fight to that magnitude, something's wrong. That's to say the absolute least, you know, and you'd hope that there is some way to fix it, but the way this already looks right now, I, uh, I don't know. The lack of color, obviously the sadness on their face. Look, look at them, just right there. I mean, we'll, we'll put this together, but it, I can almost assure you that... Oh, I see. They're facing away from each other. <sighs> but look at that. And I'm mistaken, but it doesn't look like... It doesn't even fit. Do you see that? Holy crap, it didn't fit. Oh no. This is a... This is a little... Mm, for me. No, 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 no. Game, game, no, no, no. Stop, stop. I, I, I know... I hate... Don't literally drift drift us away please game <sighs> the music is not helping whatsoever um this this <clears throat> this kind of hurts I'm not gonna lie to you guys I mean I think to suffice to say they didn't want this to happen but why, why can I not do this hold on I'm so sorry this I'm not doing this great no no no, no. okay now Can we not? There we go, geez. <clears throat> I mean, can we say that even if they have completely drifted away and they're no longer, it seems like they're no longer together, they, it seems like they're ending it in a adult-like manner and fashion. I think that's something most of us can hope for, to say the least. I mean, I I will say right now, my previous relationship, that was <clears throat> unfortunately not the case. Um, I don't know if, I, if I'm going to get into it right here, but we'll see. Moving out. All right. I don't know what his stuff is and what isn't, but... Can I, can I just take everything? I don't know if I want to do that. I, I don't know who, who's who's leaving. I thought he moved in with her, but I could be wrong. Yeah, let's see. that. Okay. Because <sighs> I don't remember what I put. I'm pretty sure it was just those. I didn't put these here, but okay. I guess they found room for it. Uh, I don't know if these books were his or anything like that. <sighs> Do I have my toothbrush at least? I 
guess that's that. This this hurts too, um, but yeah, it, it's like you do, you don't want to look at those past mementos because it's like you, it's something you don't have anymore. And it's like yeah, you think of the good times you had, but it's like it ended anyway. And it, it's just hurt to it hurts to look at. Ah. <sighs> sure that's how she feels in her life right now like she was set in this routine that he was always with her and they were together for all this time they loved each other but now this is the part the post breakup that feels weird because you're no longer you don't no longer have what's what you're accustomed to and you're not sure when that feeling is going to pass and it's it's rough reaching out to our mother I hope to God she's understanding it is always good to talk to others too What exactly is happening here? I think it was legit telling me let go, just drift away. <sighs> and continue a life. It's it's not easy. It's just an unfortunate thing that a lot of people go through. Wake up. Florence. It's another day. That's the thing. Like, even though heartache and all that happened, it's still another day. Yes, like, th this is a good outlet. Finally use the thing that you want to pursue that you're... You oh, okay, look at that. Okay. <laughs> I like this symbolism. Kind of like it's, it's a new life. As a tree grows, so does she. I, mean, I know it's a very cliche thing to say that time heals all wounds, but I think deep down I really do agree with that. I mean, you still think back to certain things. It's like, ah, but then it's like, you go on with life and you're happy. Look at, look at this. Second prize. Good job, Florence. The sketch club. <laughs> Loaf. Oh. I'm not even a cat person. That's that's pretty adorable. Yeah, look at that. She has her own freaking... Oh, well, damn. Damn, Florence. Yeah, Florence. Hell yeah. Good. Good for her. Yes. See? Moving on. It's not a bad thing, ladies and gentlemen, not at all. I always, I have the mantra in life that life and things always get better. Always. You may not see it right there, right then, but things always get better. Look at, look at her. Look at her go. 
She's like, screw you, office job. I don't need you. I thought, I think that still had some coffee in there, but it's okay. It's like, I'm gonna do some art. Screw you. Oh. You know? And once again, you, you, you may have mementos still around. They may be kind of hard to look at. And ultimately, it's like, you decide what you want to do with it. I mean, the people may not be together, but it's still a happy memory. So it, it comes down to the person, you know? You know yourself more, more than anything. Can I throw it away? Or maybe not. Okay, no, she, she's keeping it. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, uh, she did she open an art gallery, or is she like you know exhibiting in the art gallery? Good job, Florence. Yeah, appreciate the art. It's great. I've never been to an art gallery myself. It's something I may want to, like, see in the future. <laughs> yeah, make some, make some connections, Florence. Hell yeah, look at this guy. Hell yeah, rocking that top hat. <laughs> I don't know if I'd be able to do so, but... Yeah. This is great. Good for her. I loaf. And life goes on. Just like that. And is that it? Yes, there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, that was Florence. Uh, I told you guys it was like a quick little experience. I mean, with me talking and babbling, things like that, and like, you know, not going as fast as I could have been. You know, about like four, a little over 40 minutes. Um, now, without me talking and things like that, I'm sure probably only be like a half hour, half hour or so, but there we go. That was cute. Like, that was a neat little experience. Um, and I'm not really sure what my overall thoughts and opinions would be of it. Like, it's nice, you know, and honestly, it, I'm sure that's what the whole well, big purpose of the game was. It makes you kind of think back to your own life, because uh, there was a lot of things that this game touched upon that I went through personally as well. Um, it, both the good and the bad. Um, I mean, I, I don't want to go super personal, like super, super personal in you know, stories here, but the one thing I'll say is like, you know, once again, it looked like they ended the relationship in a, an adult fashion. Now, the reason why I say mine didn't really was because, uh, I mean, once again, this is, this is the only thing I'm going to get into is... Uh, cheating was involved, not by me. <laughs> First and foremost, before I say any, before I move further, wasn't me. I found out she was doing it, and well, it hurt. <laughs> I mean, it really, really hurt to say the absolute least. Um, of course, I was pissed off, and like, that's like I think at that point, like. Me being amicable was kind of out the window, and also, I'm not going to lie, I was young. I mean, my last serious relationship, it's been quite a few years. Um, now, even with that, uh, I have been... I, there's a difference, here's what I'll get into here. I think there's a difference between being in a relationship... And dating. Dating is where, in my opinion, you are 
going out with this person to learn more about them, to see if there's something viable there, and then all goes according to plan, you start going out with them, being in a relationship with them. So even though my, my last relationship was a while ago, I've been dating here and there. Um, and honestly, what I've experienced in this game uh, reminds me of a wonderful woman that I was dating last year for a little while. I mean, it wasn't super long, but uh, <laughs> in a long, the longest time, she just made me feel different about a lot of things and it just feeling like there's somebody else that cares and loves for you, you know, outside of family or friends. It, it's a nice feeling, you know? Um, but you know, unfortunately things in the end just didn't seem to work out. And that was that, you know, I mean, it's, it does suck. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I mean, it's it's one of those things like, you know, why you questioned it. Like, you thought everything was going well. She thought everything was going well. But then it just drift. <laughs> kind of like what happened here. Um, but once again, it's one of those things where I'm happy that I even had that experience just to have a period. Another cliche saying, better to have love and lost than never to have been loved at all, you know? And it's also one of those things, too, that there is no time limit, too. There's no rush to it, you know? Yeah, people, they can be like high school sweethearts and get married right after college or right after high school and they're, they're together forever and ever. And, and then there's people who don't find, like, true love until they're way later in life. You know, I guess what I'm getting at here is it's okay wherever you are in life. Life will take you in the direction that it needs to go to. And also at the same time, you need to ensure that we're taking care of ourselves. We're taking care of the ones that we love and love us back. We will get to our destination, whatever it may be. We just don't know how long it will will be, you know? So, uh, that was a pretty damn beautiful game, I'll, I'll, I'll admit. And I'm guessing it's like concept art and whatnot. Yeah, like unused art. Early concept art. Uh, the first dates chapter. I mean, this this is really cute. This was a really cute game. I really enjoyed it. Um, now, I know a lot of people may have, like, speculation, like, oh, like, is this even a game or is this worth it? Things like that. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like that. Um, but... Once again, it depends on if you saw this for yourself, was it cool to look at? Was it, was it cool to see? Um, I like, once again, I like these narrative type games. Something that's a little bit different. The Once again, the art style is what really drove me to this. I'm like, this looks kind of nice. And then I, I uh, requested to take a deeper look into it. And well, here you go. I basically showed what the entirety of the game was, but if you guys want to still experience it for yourselves, then please feel free to do so. I'll have a link to the GOG page in the description below. And uh, I always say it's a little different. Even if you've seen everything about a game, sometimes it's a little bit different when you yourself have control over the game itself. That's the way I look at it. But, oh, you know what? I haven't done this, but uh, here's the team. So, 
you guys would like, go on Facebook, give them a follow on Twitter. I think that's Instagram. Uh, the purple one up there, I'm not really sure. I have one, I just really never use it. Uh, email. But this... This is awesome. And Oh, this is, this is their first game. I just saw that right there. Oh, they're from Australia. Okay. Well, they, they did an awesome job. Personally, I, I say so anyway. That soundtrack being on Spotify, though, I may have to do that because I, I like this like little soundtrack we have in the back here. But, um... Ladies and gentlemen, this has been Florence. I hope you all really enjoyed it. Uh, I know I did. And uh, I, I hope you guys didn't mind uh, I delved a little bit more in my, my own life regarding this game. Um, I know I said earlier, oh, I don't know if I should have played this because like, right now it's like, you know, I'm, I'm a single I'm a single man and it, it just makes me think back to previous relationship dating and it's like yeah I mean there, there are great times there are really great times and, but even though I am currently single doesn't mean that I always will be or uh, yeah, this is life and that's it life takes us in funny directions you never know where we will go in a matter of a year month day minutes and i think i'm gonna keep living life like that ladies and gentlemen once again i hope you all enjoyed uh i guess my let's play <laughs> of florence love you all so much have a great day Thank you all for watching this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, feel free to leave a comment, a like, and subscribe for future content where I aim to release a video a day. And if you do subscribe, make sure to click on the bell symbol to be notified once new videos are uploaded. You can also catch me streaming from time to time on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, and join my Discord server to relax with other gamers. All this information is in the description box below. Have a great day.